erectile dysfunction, or ED, a concern that's sparking a sense of urgency and hype across the globe. Hi, I'm Emma, here to provide some insight into this daunting issue. You see, erectile dysfunction is a condition affecting countless individuals worldwide, and the triggers are as diverse as our global populace. Male sexual arousal is a ranging complex process that involves the brain, hormones, emotions, nerves, muscles, and blood vessels. Erectile dysfunction can result from a problem with any of these. Likewise, stress and mental health concerns can cause or worsen erectile dysfunction. Sometimes a combination of physical and psychological issues causes erectile dysfunction. For instance, a minor physical condition that slows your sexual response might cause anxiety about maintaining an erection. The resulting anxiety can lead to or worsen erectile dysfunction. But fear not, for today we're discussing a powerful tool in combating erectile dysfunction exercise. Yes, you heard that right. We'll be exploring five specific exercises that could help alleviate the symptoms of this condition. These exercises ranging from strengthening pelvic muscles, increase testosterone, improve cardiovascular health to enhance stamina and endurance. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more insightful content just like this. So buckle up as we delve into these exercises that could potentially turn your life around. First up, we have Kegel exercises or pelvic exercises, a scientifically backed method to strengthen your pelvic floor muscles. Kegel exercises, were initially introduced as a way for women to regain control of their bladder after childbirth. However, research has shown that these exercises can also be beneficial for men, especially those dealing with erectile dysfunction. It should be used as the first line of treatment. The ischiocavernosis and bulbocavernosis muscles in the pelvic area surround the penis and are active during an erection. According to a study published in the British Journal of General Practice, Kegel exercises can significantly improve erectile function in men. So how do you do Kegel exercises? It's quite simple. There are three types of Kegel exercises. We will guide you step-by-step step doing this important exercises. The first is floor lying on your back squeezes. Step one by start by lying on your back, hands flat on the floor and knees comfortably bent and pointing upwards. Step two, try to draw your penis inwards towards your body and hold for five seconds, then release. Step three, now squeeze your anus muscles as if you are trying to stop a bowel movement and hold for five seconds, then release. Repeat steps two and three, eight to 10 times, and do three to five sets. The next exercise is floor lying on your side squeezes. Step one, lie on the floor and on your side. Step two, place a pillow between your knees. Make sure the pillow is large enough to spread your legs apart. Step three, squeeze your legs together and hold for five seconds, then release. Repeat step three, eight to 10 times and do three to five sets. The next exercise is sitting in a chair squeezes. Step one, find a comfortable position sitting in a chair. Step two, squeeze your penis with just its muscles as if you are trying to stop urine from coming out. Hold for five seconds, then release. Step three, repeat step two, eight to 10 times and then do three to five sets. One way to test whether you're doing the squeezing correctly is to try and stop urine flow for a few seconds. If you are able to do so, you are doing it correctly. When doing these exercises, keep in mind the following tips. Don't hold your breath, breath is normal. Don't push down, instead squeeze your pelvic muscles together tightly as if you are trying to lift something up with those muscles. Try to keep your stomach muscles relaxed throughout. And lastly, relax your pelvic floor muscles between each squeeze. As your body becomes more familiar and used to these exercises, Consider increasing the length of time you squeeze and hold the different pelvic muscles. You can also increase the number of repetitions or sets of exercises you do. The benefits of Kegel exercises go beyond just improving erectile function. They also help in improving urinary incontinence, which is a common issue in men as they age. Moreover, these exercises enhance overall sexual performance by increasing the intensity of orgasms. Remember, consistency is key when it comes to Kegel exercises. It's not a quick fix, but with patience and persistence, you can experience significant improvements in your sexual health. So why not give Kegel exercises a try? They might just be the solution you've been searching for. Next, we delve into the fascinating power of aerobic exercise. Backed by scientific research, aerobic exercises have been hailed as an exceptional tool for promoting your body's overall wellness 
and combating conditions like erectile dysfunction. A wealth of research, like a study published in the Journal of Sexual Medicine, underlines the efficacy of aerobic exercises for improving cardiovascular health and providing numerous other physical benefits. This study found that regular aerobic exercise could increase sexual performance and alleviate erectile dysfunction. But how does it achieve this? The science is clear. Aerobic exercises such as running, walking, swimming, and cycling have been proven to enhance cardiovascular health, bolstering heart function, and improving blood flow throughout the body, including the pelvic region. This enhanced blood circulation can directly result in stronger and longer-lasting erections. Moreover, another study in the American Journal of Cardiology found that brisk walking, which is a gentler form of aerobic exercise, could help reduce the risk of heart disease by up to 50%, thus contributing to better overall health and consequently sexual health. Meanwhile, an article in the British Journal of Sports Medicine highlighted that exercises like swimming and cycling are not only gentle on your joints, but also provide a rigorous workout for your heart and lungs, thereby improving sexual health. The question then arises, how exactly does improved blood flow and cardiovascular health aid dysfunction? Simple, they enhance your body's stamina and endurance, enabling you to maintain physical activity for extended periods. This increased stamina could also translate into improved sexual. As to the frequency of these exercises, most health professionals recommend at least 30 minutes of moderate intensity aerobic exercise five days a week, as affirmed by the Mayo Clinic. But remember, it's always important to listen to your body and adjust your routine as necessary. The consensus in the scientific community, as evidenced by multiple studies published in reputable journals such as the American Journal of Cardiology and the Journal of Sexual Medicine, on the power of these seemingly simple exercises is evident. They not only contribute to your overall health, but can also play a significant role in enhancing your sexual health. So, whether you're an avid runner or a fan of leisurely bike rides, keep at it. Regularly incorporating aerobic exercises into your lifestyle can make a significant difference in combating erectile dysfunction. Indeed, aerobic exercise proves to be a simple yet potent way to bolster your sexual health. Next, we have strength training, an underrated but crucial component of sexual health. Now, when it comes to strength training, we're not talking about becoming a bodybuilder. Rather, we're focusing on exercises that enhance your overall strength and increase your testosterone levels, both of which can have a positive impact on sexual function. Let's start with squats. Squats are a compound exercise, meaning they work multiple muscle groups at once, including your quads, glutes, and core. This not only helps you build strength, but also stimulates the production of testosterone, a hormone that plays a vital role in male sexual function. Next up, we have lunges. Similar to squats, lunges are a great exercise for building strength in your lower body. They target your quads, hamstrings, and glutes, and can also help improve balance and stability. Then we have deadlifts. This is a powerhouse exercise that activates your entire body, from your legs and core to your back and arms. Deadlifts are particularly effective at boosting testosterone production due to the large amount of muscle they engage. Now, you might be wondering, how often should I be doing these exercises? Well, the American College of Sports Medicine recommends strength training at least two days per week. Start with one to two sets of eight to 12 repetitions for each exercise and gradually increase as your strength improves. But remember, always listen to your body and don't push yourself too hard. It's not about how heavy you lift, but how correctly and consistently you do it. To sum it up, incorporating strength training into your routine can provide a multitude of benefits for your sexual health. It can enhance your overall strength, boost your testosterone levels, and improve your confidence, all of which can help combat erectile dysfunction. So there you have it, strength training, a powerful tool to boost your testosterone levels and overall strength. Don't underestimate the power of a good workout. Remember, your health is your wealth, so take good care of it. Now, let's shift gears and explore the calming world of yoga. Yoga, an ancient practice rooted in Indian philosophy, offers a holistic approach to wellness that extends to improving sexual function. Specific poses like pelvic floor exercises, cobra pose or bhujangasana, and bridge pose or setu bandhasana are particularly beneficial. 
These poses target the pelvic region, enhancing flexibility and strengthening the muscles involved in sexual function. Moreover, yoga is a fantastic stress reducer. The meditative aspects of yoga can help alleviate anxiety, a common contributor to erectile dysfunction. By promoting relaxation and reducing stress, yoga can contribute to improved sexual health. As for the duration and frequency, we recommend practicing yoga for 30 minutes a day, at least three times a week. Consistency is key. The more regular your practice, the better the benefits. Yoga, a holistic approach to improving flexibility, reducing stress, and enhancing sexual function. And remember, yoga isn't just about the poses, it's about the journey. Last but not least, cardiovascular exercise, a high-intensity workout with impactful results. High-intensity interval training, or HIT, is a potent form of cardiovascular exercise. It involves short bursts of intense activity followed by recovery periods. Why HIT, you ask? Well, it's scientifically proven to enhance cardiovascular health, which is vital for overall wellness, and you guessed it, sexual function. When your heart's in shape, blood circulates more efficiently throughout your body, including the areas that matter for sexual health. So, how often should you engage in high-intensity interval training? Aim for about three to four times a week. These sessions don't need to be lengthy. In fact, anywhere from 10 to 30 minutes should suffice. Remember, it's all about the intensity and quality of the workout, not necessarily the quantity. Incorporating high-intensity interval training into your exercise routine can have significant benefits for your heart and, in turn, your sexual health. Cardiovascular exercise, an effective way to improve blood circulation and sexual function. And there you have it. Five exercises to combat erectile dysfunction. These are not just random exercises, but scientifically backed methods to help improve your health and well-being. Each exercise targets different areas and contributes uniquely to your overall sexual health. Remember, everyone's body is different, and so will be the results. It's essential to be patient and consistent with these exercises. Do explore other related erectile dysfunction video in our channel by clicking the top right corner. Remember, your feedback and personal stories are invaluable to us. They not only help us improve, but also inspire others in their journey. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more helpful content. Together, we can combat erectile dysfunction.